If you have not heard about the FIRE movement, listen up. It stands for Financial Independence Retire Early. It's a growing movement among millennials to save up and call it a career in their 30s or 40s. It's spurred podcasts and blogs calling for people to invest more sooner and to be more frugal about their spending. For more on the FIRE movement, we're joined by financial planner and founder of Switchback Financial, Michael Kelly. Michael, certainly appreciate your time on a Friday night. Let me ask you first. How much steam does this idea, how much is it building with your clients or people you know? Um, yeah, not so much with my clients per se, but it's definitely a, a big movement, especially in the online community. Um, there's a core foundation across Reddit streams and online communities that are, are really into jumping on this movement. So let's get to the details here, Michael. I am a millennial and this intrigues me. So how much of a lifestyle change Right now, would it take for me to say retire in a couple of years? Yeah, so that's kind of the polarizing concept around FIRE is that really it's about in your early working years, saving up to 50 to 70% of your income and then putting the income into income investing, uh, income producing investments to generate consistent revenue. Um, in order to do that though, you're taking a pretty big risk that your assumptions as you create your plan are able to stay consistent over time. So growing up, we're often told to contribute to a 401k, some lucky enough to work for a place with a pension. Is the idea to shift those investments in those traditional re retirement accounts and invest elsewhere, like you said, stocks, bonds, perhaps? Uh, yeah, it's definitely a mix. Um, you can't be putting into your traditional uh, retirement savings quite as much because you can't touch those until you're in your 60s. and so. Really, you need to put money into typical brokerage accounts um, and you need to be really prudent about what investments you put them into. Um, it, it's rooted in a good, solid financial planning principles, however, making savings a priority, uh, keeping spending below your means. And what I love about it is it really focuses on your values and not merely acquiring more money. Yeah, it'd be tough with the cost of rent here in the Bay Area. Michael, I've got one more question. We've reported a lot about the pandemic-driven great resignation. The desire to get out of that nine-to-five grind, is that helping drive this movement, you think? Uh, absolutely. Um, that's the big push around it is people not wanting to feel locked up to their desk. Um, it's, in my opinion, the pendulum's moving a little bit too far in some cases, um, but people want to get away from the desk. They want to be able to go pursue passion projects. And so if fire can help, push that, then it's definitely a better thing to get people focused on retiring and saving earlier on. All right. Certainly something to consider. Switchback Financials, Michael Kelly, thank you so much for joining us tonight, sir. Thank you. Appreciate it.